starting this video i just wanted to let you guys know that if you haven't followed me on my instagram yet make sure you guys follow because i upload a bunch of updates there and i'm currently having a giveaway so make sure you guys enter that hey guys and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new don't forget to subscribe and like this video i hope you all are at your home staying safe now you already know by the title today we're going to be doing the mystery wheel of slime challenge i'm so excited for this challenge and i wanted to do this challenge for a very long time but didn't get around it so today is the day finally we're going to be doing it i know you can't believe it i'm doing a hand drop but yeah without further ado let's just get on to the challenge starting off we first have to pick our glue and this wheel will help us decide And the wheel chose white glue for our base for the slime so in my bowl I'm pouring some white glue next the wheel will help us decide which slime ingredient we will be adding to our base so let's see And it says foam soap so I'm adding that in my white base I'm not adding too much and then mixing it with my spatula now to choose the color I just hope it does not land on brown let's see what the wheel chooses and the wheel chose pink color i also decided to let the wheel decide between food coloring or paint and the wheel picked food coloring so far it's going pretty well so i'm now just adding some drops of food coloring into my glue and mixing that up I really love this pastel pink color so I'm adding no more coloring to it and next it's time to activate it and for my activator I use one teaspoon of borax mixed in with one cup of warm water and we're just kneading it up and forming it into the slime. Next up is slime texture and the wheel says Microfoam. Honestly, I'm super happy as I haven't made a white glue microfoam before. So let's see whether we'll get a semi microfoam or a full microfoam. So let's see what the wheel decides. And the wheel chose semi foam. So in my bowl, I'm adding microfoam beads and then mixing it up with my slime. It is so satisfying to watch the beads drop and the slime mixing it in. So I'll let you guys watch it. Time to choose our slime add-ins which is my favorite part about this whole video and I decided to spin the wheel two times for extra fun. And the wheel says sprinkles. Now for the second add-in spin and let's see what it is. It's female slices. I'm really glad I got these two as my slime add-ins though. So I have my slime here and I made a very cute sprinkle and female mix. It is so cute. I love it so much.
For the last and final spin, the wheel will pick whether we add a charm or not. And it's a yes, that means we will be adding a charm onto our slime. This slime was giving me strawberry vibes, so I decided to go with the theme and add this cute little strawberry eraser that I received as a gift for the charm. And here is the slime all completed. Surprisingly, it turned out really good and I love how everything matches together so well. up for today's video i hope you enjoyed this video a lot i loved filming this video and let me know if you want more of these type of videos i'm definitely gonna do that for you guys and that is up i will see you guys next time bye